you guys. Welcome back to Stampaholics Anonymous. Today we are going to look at another fun creative shop plate. This is plate number 95. Wow, I'm trying to make uh, sentences and words that make sense. So this is creative shop 95 and I am also trying to not blind you guys but also give you a decent amount of light which is I think impossible today. Um, anywho, so this is Creative Shop 95. I have painted my nails, you know, like I usually do. Two weird colors when we're doing like 10, ten swatches of a um, of a plate. Uh, so this one is again sort of alien themed. Uh, and my favorite image is this little alien inside of a kitty. Um, cause I am 100% sure that both of my cats are aliens, uh, and then they possess the power of, um, you know, traveling through time and space via black holes, um, and do that frequently, because <laughs> they always show up in places where you least expect them. So, um, there's a bunch of cute, um, alien-related, um, images on here. There's a really cute one with, uh, an alien with that flower crown, really cool. This one says, ew, people, and this one is abducting um, bacon which you know what not to love about bacon um yeah and thusly I have painted my nails in two colors that will hopefully go along with the uh, alien theme but are not re like repetitive from the last time we did something alien themed um, on my good hand is this awesome neon green by um, Omar Lacquer. unfortunately that's one of the bottles where the label got lost um, but this polish is called Leonie Omar Lacquer is a UK based indie brand if you live in the UK you should definitely go check her out she does amazing polishes like this awesome neon green right here um and on my other hand we've got a moonshine mani from the tv something collection what's it called the totally tubular there we go and this is it is so choice that um quote from Ferris Bueller's uh, Day Off, the movie. And it's a pink polish that has a bunch of shimmer going on, pink and purple shimmer. Um, but we're going to be stamping over it anyway, so you're not going to see much of that shimmer. So before I talk myself into more of a mess than I already am, I'm going to set up for stamping and do the swatches without talking and let you enjoy all of the alien goodness on this uh, plate. And then I'm going to meet you back for a final wrap up after the swatches.
Alrighty, you guys, that were my quick swatches of the Creative Shop 95 plate. And well, it's easy to predict with a Creative Shop plate, but these turned out amazing. I like them a lot. I especially like um, that you get like both those cutesy creative um, images, but then you get some good like full nail patterns to combine them with. Um, and that's what I really, really like. I really like this Art Deco style kind of a thing over here. You could color it in, you could leave it as is. You could probably go and like um, layer stamp it, you know, with like a slight offset with another color. That would look amazing to give it like a 3D effect. You could color in your aliens. You could do so many things with these plates or with this plate <laughs> and pretty much every other Creative Shop plate there is in the world. So overall, I'm really, really happy. Um, this one, even though being a newer one, it did create a lot of uh, cotton ball fuzz if you're interested in that but um, overall I really don't mind that and you know how big of a creative shop fan I am um, and I have more stuff coming from them because they had a really really amazing deal um, for Black Friday or Cyber Monday um, with I think 40% off or something I'm gonna you know I'm gonna hurl everything that I have bought for um, Cyber Monday and uh, Black Friday on this channel. It's probably not going to be all at the same time because some of it is, you know, being shipped not to me but to Louie in the States because she was kind enough to, you know, um, be my mule for Black Friday. Um, anyway, I love this plate. I really like the creative um, uh, aliens on here and the way it's set up and the way that you can get, you know, full nail images to combine with creative animal, uh, animals. Why am I saying animals? Images. That's the word I want to say. Um, let me know what your favorite creative shop plate is or which one you've been loving lately. There's more creative shop coming. I have like one more born pretty store video to get out of the way, so to speak. And then we're into the last three creative shop plates before I show you my haul. So that's it for today, you guys. I love you very, very much, and I will talk to you next time. Bye!